and that's how you start a video. Hello and welcome to Retro VHS. Gotta write that time Retro VHS now. Um massive fan of Corey Hame, Corey Feldman. Actually got to meet Corey Feldman yesterday. Hey, that's a picture of us. Anyway, um this appeared on Amazon and it's probably one of the expensive VHSs that I've purchased. Um again it had no picture. I read the description, I was like, right, okay, a big box VHS. I mean it might not even be what I think it is. But Corey here made two films early on in his career. Um Demolition High and Demolition University. Now I do have Demolition High on DVD as background, Japanese import. It's never seen the light of day in any shape or form in the UK from VHS to DVD to ongoing. It is on Amazon Prime. Um, and recently I got this. Brit is off camera pulling a funny face. Anyway, what's the matter? Matty Connor. What's Matty Connor said? Well, I sent him that picture and I said, good morning, condog. Stephen said to send you this. He went, hello, pizza buddy. Can you email the biggest file so we can have, have it in the biggest format? Give us the email address, sent us loads of kissy face emojis, a glass of milk and said, have some milk with a hug emoji. Oh, that's my friend Matthew Connor. <laughs> anyway, um, right, okay, I'm not even going to jump cut that because that's reference to that picture because I'm wearing Steel Town Music's t-shirt like I'm wearing in Evil Hour. Right, okay, back to what I was talking about. Anyway, <laughs> so back in the day, big box VHSs, um, I walked into Global one day and the new releases were coming out and I just you know walked past and I, and I went back over and I looked at the VHS on the wall and um, I was like, is that Corey here? Like, because it's a bright green luminous fucking box and his name isn't even across the top and Big B, Beryl at the time, um, who worked at Global, I was like, is that that? And I bought one straight away. Barrel was awesome themselves. They had a couple. So yeah, the second one came out, so it's Demolition University. And again, it's one of the ones I lost. And for my original collection now, I'm only missing just one of the girls and Murphy's Romance. Original. What was that squeak? Is that you? It's a fucking hell. What? Sounds like a bloody animal getting <coughs> in the background. I thought, sorry. Quiet. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Anyway, thanks, Brittany. Anyway, 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 anyway. Right. What the fuck was I saying? I don't know. Right. right. Someone that you're missing. Yeah, right, and the only other two I will not get back is my rare Dream a Little Dream and Watchers, which were New Zealand ones. You can see Dream a Little Dream just face on in the background there. And I've got a really rare Watchers from Germany. So, the new generation. Anyway. Let's have a look. So this should be a big box VHS. And again, you're flying by off Amazon. Um, I would, however, show you. Oh, I, I would, there's a proper treat. So this is a Corey Hame, Corey Farman, me ranting in the side there. I can't even get in this one. The package is inside. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's one of them. For fuck's sake. It's like moldy. Come in. It's the packaging. Insistent baby, but jump cut. I can't cut that out. Stay there. Ping. Good job of doing this one before the horror comedy. I know it's Matthew Connor. Jump cut. Matthew Connor is beeping in the background. Anyway, it is fluffy, and I've just dropped it. And look at all that fluff all now over the fucking floor. That is ridiculous. Like literally. This, this is what's happening right now. Are we rolling on the B camera? Fucking fluff. Everywhere. Everywhere. So yeah. <laughs> anyway. Right, it is what it was. It is what it was. It is back in my collection. Um, it's an 18 rated. It's got a thank you card. Thank you, many thanks. I'm selling my massive collection of over two. It's him. It's this guy. It, strange enough, I have actually bought off this guy before. It's the same guy. It's the same guy I got Double O Kid from. Um, Burbs, um, Dark Man. Hello, you alright? <laughs> so, yeah, there it is. Rocky Rocky. Demolition University. Green Box. Now, Corey Hames' name is not across the top. Um, this time. They're about to take the test of the impossible. And it's going to be weird. 
So on the back cover, um, it also stars Amy, I can't pronounce the second name, but I'm sure she was in Life 101. Actually, that's another American big box, little box I had. And it's inside. So it's a Warner Brothers release, which is pretty cool. This is X rental. Um, it's not a flip cover, has been rewound. Um, it's absolutely lush. Absolutely lush green cover. It's a really nice cover. It's just why it doesn't have Corey Ham across the top. It's really weird. And there's the back of the box. And there, inside. Nice to rewound. Now I have both won this guy before and he is reasonably priced. I mean this was £30, but it's like rare as fuck racy. So yeah, see you in the outtakes. Now this outtake will be pretty sweet because it's going to be, I mean, I've, I've got loads of retro VHSs. I haven't even edited it yet from months ago. Um, and there's a slow motion one. There's a couple I've picked up recently. And this has been on um, one of, it's an old retro VHS. It even had its own jumpy cutty one. But this is rare as fuck. It's a big box, Edge of Honor, Corey Feldman movie, spongy. Um, sort of pre sir but spongy, but now officially signed by Corey Feldman himself. And yeah, it's the one VHS I took when I met Corey Feldman. I said, you know what, I'm going to take the rarest of the rarest, not my favourite of the favourites. And I wasn't going to get one with Corey Hame and Corey Feldman, because I'm never, unfortunately, going to get Corey Hame to ever sign it. So, that has had its own video before, in the story about it is on my channel. And it's Steve Mason, this has been Retro VHS. Thanks for watching and goodbye. And now, the end is here.